This could have ended a lot worse for that porch pirate. Reapers, what is good? It's your boy Laser. We're back with another scary reaction video. Happy Sunday, guys. I hope you all are having a good day so far. But now we're going to get straight into this video. This one is called The 15 Most Disturbing Things Caught on Doorbell Cameras. We've seen those doorbell camera videos, guys, and they're so fun to watch, not going to lie. But um, it's by Fear Tales. And if you haven't already, guys, you know the drill. You hit that like button, you subscribe, and you turn notifications on. Let's get straight into this video. Video. We'll oh, be looking at the 15 most disturbing things caught on doorbell camera. Number 15. This guy's music and intro is always scary, dude. This video was posted by Doorbell News on June of 2022. What's he got, the Chinese food? Here, we see a strange old man walking up to this house and trying to break in. He got that Chinese food. He has two bags in his hand, and I don't know what's inside them. He checked the door, but it was locked. What's his mask? Is that a mask he's wearing? I can't tell. Look at those skinny ankles down there. <clears throat> those ankles more Always than keep your doors locked to be safe from these strange guys. This video is from San Francisco, where this man had a crazy encounter with this female porch pirate. She was blocking access to the door. Um, when she did start to descend down the stairway and I was, you know, yelling at her, just keep going, right? Keep going. And that is when the guy says his encounter with the woman turned violent. Surveillance video captured it as the guy arrived at 8.30 Friday night at his house on Lake Street in San Francisco. At one point, the woman knocks the package off his arms. She was kicking the door hitting the door with some metal objects and with the knife, Chill. slashing and, and stabbing motion. The guy managed to call 911 and get inside his home She's right, right before things escalated even more. The guy feared for his life and thankfully, soon after, the police arrived quickly, making an arrest. As for the woman in the video, she either has drug addiction or mental illness. I swear every person in these doorbell videos 100% has to be on some sort of substance, dude. Because Jeez. there's just no way. The way they like are so aggressive and all that, they have to. Same with those Karens, dude. In this video, this man was caught breaking into this house while the homeowner was at home. The man confronts him, but he says he's just here to look into the apartment. We got a porch pirate over here. Oh, how, you how you doing, man? No, I got a call. The place was empty. I was supposed to come to look at the apartment. 301-1967. Why did it look like he was it's making it out? It looks the... like he saw many packages. I swear it looked like he was making out the door for a second. And assumed no one was home. The clothing is just to throw people off. Also, handymen usually have tools. Sketchy dude. Call the cops and let them check him out. What do you think about him? Let me know in the comments. Strange, strange indeed. There was a fight in this neighborhood where these three men had a misunderstanding. It was two versus one guy, and they pushed the guy a little too far. Oh, snap. They got that Just Do It shirt. That Just Do It hoodie. Oh, shit. Somebody's screaming. They're doing it, all right. Here we fucking go, boy. Here we fucking go, boy. Damn. I hope the three gentlemen peacefully found a way to settle their differences, although very likely not. Oh, snap. This burglar acts as if he lives here. Yay, I live here. <laughs> so he walks up Why to this house and like takes that? a yawn to look natural, but he knows he's full of it. He looks right into the camera with a smirk. Yeah, his whole face got caught by the camera. 
He tries to open the door with a bunch of keys right. in his it's hand, my property but it doesn't now. open up. It's my property this now, is on boy. Christmas Day also, when everyone's at home. So this guy is clearly out of his mind. This is a really weird so far. <laughs> this lady tries to steal the packages from this house and hides the boxes under her shirt. Check this out. Ain't no way. Don't steal the Amazon package. How does she think hiding it under her shirt's gonna do it? Whoa, that's a lot of boxes under one shirt. It's like, you literally, like, what is she supposed to say when she just walks past someone? Like, <laughs> I'm pregnant, like what? These two guys try to get into this house, and for two days in a row, they drove a white or gray Ford truck. Eminem, is that you? In the video, you can see these punks walk up and have hoodies on. One of them seems to think it was funny that they were trying to break into this guy's house. Man looks like Eminem. The guy in the blue hoodie had a smirk on his face. They don't look like robbers. They look like high school kids. Luckily, the homeowner scares them off. Literally anyone could be a robber. What was the point of that? <laughs> They're gone. What the f do you want? I'm gonna call the police right now and put some charges. The video has been sent to authorities to identify plates and press charges to look for them. I hope the police catch them soon and teach them a lesson. Their biggest mistake was not wearing any sort of mask or whatever. <laughs> like literally I could clearly see their faces. Besides the quality. This is the smartest porch pirate you'll ever see in your life. I'm impressed by this guy. He, got that he walks around with a cane, but uses the cane to fish out packages from behind people's gates or doors. So he is trying to fish out someone's boxes, but when he sees things aren't working key. with the cane, an idea hits him. He gets the idea of getting one of those trash pickers that you can grab items with, oh, and look, snap, he came by the next day and was able to capture the object. So That's impressive. Through? You gotta give him an A for being creative. If this guy would put this type of energy into something positive, he'd probably be great. <laughs> nah, but that's gotta be the first robber I've seen in these videos that like actually is kind of smart. All the other ones are like, no. 200 IQ right there. In this video, you can see a thief walking up and trying to open the first car, and then he gets inside the second car. But if you look closely, he has a weapon drawn. So imagine you get a notification from your Ring app and you see someone's out. So you now run outside and try to confront him, not knowing he has a weapon in his hand. The thing to do in these scenarios is just call the police. These thieves have nothing to lose. Sometimes it's best to just call the authorities instead of trying to be a hero. I swear, and that's another thing, I don't understand, like, Honestly, in 2022, guys, like, I don't even really understand why people bother trying to rob houses. Because it's like, literally every house has, like, the ring cameras now. Like, I think that's just, like, normal now in society to have a ring camera on your house. I don't know one house that doesn't have that now. It's like, what's the point? In this video, a porch pirate messes with the wrong old man. In the average day in Detroit. A suspected porch pirate pulls up in a silver SUV and walks up the driveway unsuspecting, intending to steal the package on the porch. It looks like it could be a laptop or something like that. Little did he know, the old man was ready for him. Well, he was ready, all right. Yeah, yeah. I, I, I saw you when you got out the motherfucking car. Oh you shit! Put my back on this motherfucking porch. Let's go. You lost your motherfucking mind. You were coming from my and took my. <laughs> this could have ended a lot worse for that porch pirate. Dude, it's like in that situation. Imagine how awkward that shit is, and it, you just look like a like an actual loser in that situation. It's like you're literally like, okay, I'm sorry, I'm sorry. It's like <laughs> so awkward, dude. This guy wearing a helmet came up with an interesting story to get this door open for him. 
Check this out. Hello, um, I don't live here, but I'm trying to get out, but the gate won't recognize my motorcycle, so oh, uh, yes, if you can come to the door, that'd be great. If not, you can suck a dick. <laughs> <laughs> or call the cops, I don't give a fuck. Fuck y'all niggas, bro. <laughs> yeah, call the cops. There's no one opening the door for you at 2 a.m. It's all right, guys. So I'm going to go to a house at 2 in the morning, and I'm going to be like, all right, suck a dig because you didn't <laughs> whatever. He said he brought his bike, too, and like he can't get What do out. you think? Is his story real, or is he lying just to break into the house? Let me know in the comments. That is so... What was the man thinking, like... Some guys are in the back butchering up some fresh meat. Maybe he had a drink or two. Who knows? We got an RV pod. Not the food, man. That waste of food. No. He landed on the stones, too. That must the question been. is, is the meat still good? <laughs> and will you eat it or throw it away? What would you do with the meat? I think that was the first video on here that wasn't even like that bad. They just, like it wasn't robbers or anything. They just dropped their food. But what meat were they cooking them? A creep in a red hoodie is seen walking down the street. He sees a nice bike that looks like it could be expensive and he goes for it. You can't leave these expensive mountain bikes out in plain view. People want those. He tries to be sneaky about it and opens the gate slowly. Sure, man, He's boy. really a creep. Yeah, you got your face on camera, buddy. It looks like he could be about 18 or 19 years old. I wonder what kind of bike that is. <laughs> those mountain bikes aren't cheap. I Dude, I never understand. It's like, I get he's looking to see if there's a camera, but it's like looking at it like many times is not going to do anything it's just going to make your situation worse i've seen some of those cost five to ten thousand bucks don't leave those bikes outside he needed that bike so this porch pirate decided to use a paper bag as a mask i mean how creative was this guy he couldn't even buy a mask At least he, wore he takes a paper bag and puts it over his head what a scumbag Stay tuned for our number one pick that will shock you. Shock me, alright. Alright, number one. What do we got here? This female thief got confronted by a homeowner who was happy to exercise his Second Amendment rights. In Vegas? It's 3.50 in the morning. There's no reason this lady should be knocking at this person's door at this time. I don't know, maybe she needs help. And I'll let the homeowner tell the story of exactly how it happened. Check it out. All right, so this happened to me at 3.48 this morning, right? This lady walks up to my door, doesn't Why do I hear the purge or even on? knock. She fakes like she's knocking. But my camera notified me there was a person at the door. So some of you guys have seen people do this before. you have heard about it. They act like they're in trouble or they're distressed. And then they try and get into your house for like a home invasion. So I grabbed my second amendment and uh, look what happened. Three, one. Oh, hi. I'm sorry. What the f*** are you doing? It's 3 3 Unfortunately, the Ring app records in the 30 second loops. Oh, and it just snap. happened at that 30 seconds is when she walked away. That's how you do it. Great job by the homeowner. Thanks for. That's how you handle that situation. It's like you, you're like, get the fuck off my porch, and then you held, you hold that firearm or whatever, dude. I don't have one, but it's like, I'm just saying. Like, that guy handled it really good. Nah, but guys, this was a really good video to react to. I am, These doorbell videos are honestly my favorite. Like, I should make this, like, a completely different separate series. Like, like, a whole schedule for this. If you guys enjoy these videos, let me know. Like, let me know in the comments. But, um, I guess that's it, guys. I'll see you in the next one. Peace.